right guys welcome back to another episode of going medieval we're on episode i think seven now i'm not sure we might be on eight <laughs> one of the two but um we got quite a bit of stuff done um last episode so i wanted to go ahead and continue working on some stuff um main thing that I want to work on is getting this part all mined out. Looks like um, our guy here is mining all that, which is great. Just need to make sure that anything that he does mine isn't going to be ending up at the bottom there. But just wait for the autosave. Midnight. Yeah, so he's the guy that's nocturnal, or night owl. That's the thing that he gets he works better during the night so and looks like our, our we've been working on our herbs a little bit more trying to mine out uh harvest those out plant put down some of the um wood parts just to kind of decorate it a little bit more this also helps with the um seeds and stuff like that too so when they are put onto the um mind it will go on to the edge here and you can kind of see what I've been doing over here which looks really good so far and we still have to make up um, quite a bit of the limestone bricks or buy some one of the two but we got the library finished yesterday as well so we got that all set up and we do need more bookshelves I think we're running low on these ones so I'm going to go ahead and duplicate that, put that over here. That'll give us a little bit more um, room to actually do that with. I'm not sure if we have these all filled up. Looks like we're on our last one there too. So let's, let's go ahead and place a couple more of these down. And we'll do the other side there. Yeah, that's good then. And we'll go ahead and maybe add a couple more of these. Just so we have enough books for the entire thing here. And I have wood here, though we don't really need it at the moment. Well, I guess we do. We have half the library to still finish. And we're going to need to start making the stone bricks or buy some or something like that. Our first harvest for the um, flax should be happening soon. Now, I'm almost wondering if we should... Um, because sometimes you can get diseases for plants in this game. And I'm almost wondering if we should uh, restrict what we do grow. Um,
Alright, so still working on some of the parts here. Uh, no one seems to be gardening the plants. I'm not sure what's going on. Um, let's see here. Hauling the stockpile. Gardening. Okay, that's not going to be enough gardeners, I don't think. So I'm going to tell these guys to garden instead. And those ones are a cook, so that's really mandatory. Uh, research. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell them to garden these two, these two extra people, and then hopefully that will help a little bit more. I don't know. It's just a matter of playing. Like, it would be better to have a few extra people. Um, but as the settlement gets bigger and stuff like that, the people get more rare to join the settlement. So it might even be a few more years before we even see one at this point. So, um, however, we're doing pretty good. Um, happy with the progress. I started putting on the roof for the... Uh, part up here. Uh, it takes a little bit of time to actually figure out what I want for the style and stuff, but um, for example, I don't know if I want to do that or just kind of playing around with the roof, seeing what looks best, you know, just, just to see um, if that would work or if I should do something a little bit different, like maybe I could go with Something like this. I'm not sure if that would look good. That doesn't look like that would look good, but I don't know. Just kind of messing around with it a little bit just to see what it would. Different designs and stuff, right? Um, now, this part underneath here is probably going to be filled in uh, with floor, so we don't really need to worry about too much there. But if we're going to do something like this, then I don't think that's going to work too well. But, I don't know, just kind of playing around with it, trying to see what um, would look best. Like, do I want something like that, or should I go with something like this? There's also the other one like that. I, like, just playing around and seeing kind of the overall structure and seeing what it looks like. I think I like it like this with the little corner piece, but... Um, yeah, it's just like, I don't know, like some of these parts are a little bit harder to decorate.
right, so we're going to have a battle pretty soon. We have um, some bandit over here just waiting for uh, negotiation. And I'm just like, nah, <laughs> I'm good. Pretty sure we can take them on, so I'm not worried about it. Uh, what we will do is, in a couple minutes, uh, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and uh, get everyone prepared. And uh, they're already wearing most of the armor that we have provided, so... We should be able to get um, our archers up on the uh, thing there. We'll have um, a builder down at the uh, base there. And I think we'll send Andrew out there. And we'll send him, park him over here. And that will give us a little bit of time. So let's go ahead and just um, start getting people into divisions. We'll probably do about that many. And we'll put them over here. And then for the other archers, we'll get them over on this side. And then we'll get Andrew over here, ready to build that part up. That should give it enough time for everyone to get there. Looks like the rain stopped as well. So, take a couple seconds for everyone to get in to their location. So, just waiting for everyone. Don't know where Andrew is. Andrew's there. Alright, there we go. He's got a pretty big axe. Not sure what we got. Uh, prepare your settler settlers for battle. Oh, we get to like two extra hours for that. I didn't realize that. Okay, that's good to know. Um, we'll go ahead and send everyone up here then. Or should we not reveal our card right then? Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna just wait and we'll speed up the time and then we'll go ahead and get everyone situated I think and then we can get everyone along the wall and defend the uh, gate there so we'll do that and um, hopefully in the time lapse there will be a good battle for you guys imminent settlers are exhausted Oof. So we got uh, the battle over. Uh, there was we got everyone except for one person, which got away. But um, 
it was it was pretty eventful we took out the archers first there was only four archers and then we by then they broke down the door and they just kind of caught huddled into that room there and we just sniped most of them and then there was like three i think left and then we sniped two when they were leaving and one got away and we got most of the gardening done uh this guy's still planting uh he does like night shifts and i started working on the library roof so this is basically what i got for the design so far i needed some scaffolding on these parts just to finish the um work there but we'll see how that turns out um, outside of that, if you want to support the channel, uh, what you can do is you can actually subscribe and uh, leave a comment. Uh, that helps with the algorithm. Also, rating the video does as well. So if you give a thumbs up or thumbs down, it helps with the algorithm knowing that uh, people are enjoying the content and stuff like that. So uh, that will help me kind of progress a little bit more. But definitely subscribe because that will help me get to the milestone for the channel, um, which I still need about 500 uh, subs before I can start monetizing and uh, that will really contribute to actually make the progress of the channel itself. But outside of that, um, again, if you're new to my channel, uh, definitely consider subscribing and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.